Welcome to this week's vlog and a very happy Hari Raya to those of you who've been celebrating. Thank you too to the staff who worked yesterday on a public holiday to make sure that our diploma and our MYP external exams could go ahead um, on schedule. This coming week is the last week of the diploma and MYP exams. I'm sure our students will be very happy when they're over. During this week, we have once again been reviewing all of our COVID regulations in the light of what is happening with COVID cases in Singapore. I want you to be reassured that um, should we necessarily have to go into home-based learning, we are absolutely ready. In the meantime, however, we've had to change around some of our events we had hoped to bring parents on campus for the PYP exhibition, but sadly, that's not going to be possible. So our PYP exhibition will be, will be virtual. Our graduation, which is due to take place next week, is also a very scaled back event um, and will be live streamed to parents. So these are things that we unfortunately have to do because of the current situation. At this point in the school year, it's the time when we do lots of reviews of our processes, of our teaching, of our subject areas, and so on. One of the things that we do annually is to have a series of focus groups where we gather data on how well and how effective we have been in meeting the goals that we have as a professional organization. So in the next few days, you will receive through Banish Back an invitation to a virtual uh, parent meeting where we will do a deep dive into some of the areas of our CIS WASC community sur survey that you completed a few weeks ago. So we will tease out some of the, the findings and do a, a deeper dive. And this information is incredibly important because it feeds into our strategic plan review which will take place right before we close um, for the summer break. Other things that are happening is, as you know, um, I'm retiring from leadership at the end of this academic year, and we are transitioning in a new leadership team. You will be hearing this week from a member of our new leadership team, and I'm spending a lot of time handing over processes uh, and making sure that the new team coming in has the best start possible in August. Of course, um, as Head Emeritus, I will be around to help and uh, to give that institutional information to make sure that everything goes smoothly. I also wanted to let you know that um, as we complete our teacher recruitment for the next academic year, we are absolutely delighted that three very experienced IB teachers and former ISS teachers are going to return to ISS. This is so wonderful for our community. They bring a wealth of knowledge, a wealth of experience, and they are so happy to be coming back to join the ISS community. More about that later. Have a wonderful week ahead and I look forward to talking to you next week.